Hey guys, it's Land of Blake with Refine Horizons, and this is a short video that I, uh, I'm going to do that kind of shows you a little bit about how to spruce up your LinkedIn profile. So, uh, not exactly what I would call a LinkedIn power user, but I'm fairly active on LinkedIn, and my team has been bugging me. They're like, Landon, we need some help with our LinkedIn profiles, and I was like, man, good for you, good for our business. Let me see what I can do. So. In this video, I want to show you what I laid out for my team, and you know, if you're a manager or business developer, um, you know, marketing person, you can help your team maybe in a similar way. So, all right, so let's look at what I got. So I set up a folder here, uh, just a LinkedIn folder in our marketing folder in our network drive, and uh, I'm not going to get into uh, detail here, but we do have a little checklist. You know, uh, a little checklist, it's things you can check for on your LinkedIn profile. So that's cool. Give your, give your folks a checklist. And then let's see what else do we got over here. Um, I've got some example content. I don't even remember what's in here. Um, oh, yeah, okay. So, you know, profile summary, headline, um, you know, just kind of gives people an idea of what they can put in their first couple sections of their profile. So the... That's cool. Uh, you don't want to write this for people, but you can give them an idea, you know, give them a place to start. All right, so, but the main thing I wanted to show my folks, so there's a checklist in here. I've got some example content for your profile and your headline, but um, in this folder, SFTT, this is stuff for the team, uh, I've got three folders here. So I've got some banner images they can pick from if they want. Uh, I've got some sample headlines. Again, not trying to write my headlines for my people, but just trying to give them some ideas, place to start. And then if they want, I've got some initial posts here. I've got seven initial posts that they can use. I'll, I'll walk you through that in a second. So and let me just say right here, because I, I don't want to get roasted on social media. Um, my people have full control over their LinkedIn account. I'm not telling them what they can and can't post on LinkedIn. <laughs> they asked me for some help, and I wanted to give them a place to get started. So these are just this is these are just all suggestions for the team. Of course, when my team shares information about the company, I'm always thrilled that they do that. That's a great way they can support me and they can support our team. But I don't make anybody do it, and I don't tell them they have to do it. So don't roast me. Okay, I've got great people that want to help with the marketing, and they ask me to to give them the tools to do that. And so that's what this video is about. Okay, so. I've got some banner images in here that I made. Um, if, if you want some help with this for your team, I can certainly help you do that. Uh, you, I do, you can do it in Inkscape. There's another online photo editor called Be Funky that will let you set this. LinkedIn gives you the dimensions they want. So uh, let me just go show you um, uh, how we can change the, the header. So if you're on LinkedIn, if you're on your homepage, and you want to do some work on your profile, the first thing you want to do is you come over to where it says Me, and then uh, we're going to say uh, View Profile. Okay, and when you pull this up, if you're logged in, um, you're going to get these little pencils that let you edit stuff. Okay, so I'm just going to show you real quick how to change the banner image. So I'm going to click this pencil right here. It's a picture of my good buddy Frank. Uh, I'm going to get rid of Frank. Sorry, Frank, I love you, but uh, trying to show show people how to do this. So I'm going to say, all right, we're going to get rid of Frank. So I'm going to go to that folder. So RH team, nope, sorry, RH marketing. Social media, LinkedIn, stuff for the team, banners, and I'm going to pick a new banner. I'm going to say, you know what, I'm tired of looking at Frank, I'm going to put my new friend Danny on there. Okay, so it's going to give you that image, you can reposition it a little bit if you want. These image dimensions should be pretty close. So I'm going to say, hmm, you know, where do I want this? Eh, we're going to go right there. Okay, so give that a minute. Boom, now I got Danny on my LinkedIn profile. Okay, now I'm probably going to change that because, I don't know, I feel a little funny having Danny on my LinkedIn profile. Um, that'd be a good photo for Danny to have on his LinkedIn profile. <laughs> so I'm going to pick this. I don't know why it didn't bother me to have Frank on my LinkedIn profile, but all right, so I like this is a UAV photo I took in the subdivision we worked on. I'm going to go ahead and put that in there. I like it. Ah, oh, Butamus. All right, so I've got that in there now. Um, it's really easy. Same thing if you want to update your, your image. I like this image because I'm about 10 years younger in this image, and so I get to fool everybody, so I'm just going to leave it for now. 
I should probably replace that at some point with an image that has more wrinkles and less hair. Um, so that's on my list of things to do. All right, so that takes care of the banner image. Let's see what else was in our folder here. Um, so I've got under headlines. So if you come back to stuff for the team under headlines, I've just got some sample headlines for you guys. There's a Word doc and a PDF. Um, so, uh, you know, uh, here's some different headlines you could pick, right? Uh, maybe your meticulous survey CAD tech working hard to provide beautiful, beautiful maps and other surveying work products. Or your future land surveyor helping clients in California uh, effectively develop their land. I guess I shouldn't have the typo in there. Oh, I need to fix that. Um, you know, my, so my, it's time to update my headline. It hasn't been uh, updated in a while. I, I like this one right here. So uh, let's go, uh, let's open that Word doc real quick. I'm having Microsoft Office bugs, so I'm using this free software. By the way, this is pretty good free software. It's called Free Office. Uh, Microsoft rolled out some kind of update, and my office got baked. <laughs> so uh, let's go open that headline, uh, Word doc, so we can just copy stuff out of there. Let's get rid of this typo. Sorry about that, guys. You guys know I'm not perfect if you watch my videos very long. All right, so I like this headline here. It's a good starting point, so I'm going to copy that. And uh, let's come over here and um, let's see. I gotta remember how to edit this heading. I think it's right here. Click this pencil. Yep, there you go. So I'm gonna say uh, land surveyor working hard to facilitate smooth real estate transactions. And I'm just gonna add and land development projects in Central California and Western Nevada. Okay, so a little update to my headline, a little update to my banner image. I'm going to be like a whole new man. You can see that showing up here. Okay, so I wanted to show you that. Alright, so then... So that covered the banner, the headlines. Then I've got these initial posts. So my people are like, what do we post on LinkedIn? You know, I like to share... Um, Helpful stuff. I share job postings. I share people that are looking for work. Um, you know, I share interesting industry news. But a lot of my people are like, well, we don't know what to post on LinkedIn. That's okay. You know, it, it takes a little while to figure out what you like, what you enjoy, what other people find useful. So, hey, I just put together some sample posts for them. Um, so, just to give you an example here. So, some of these have uh, content, just content. If it's usually, if it's just content, there's a link that to a YouTube video where the YouTube video thumbnail shows up as the image. But if it's a post without a, a video link there, I've put an image in here. You always want to try and share an image with your post. So this is a post about my buddy Danny passing the CFT. Um, I don't know if I have one on here that I haven't posted yet. Let's look and I, I can show you how to post it. So let's go open post 7. Yeah, so I posted this once, but it's been a couple weeks, so I'll post it again. So just come in here. Again, this is going to link to a YouTube video with a thumbnail. I'm just going to copy this. Okay. And then I'm going to come in now. When you're ready to, pu to put in a post, you go back to your home. Okay, and right here at the top says start post. So I'm just going to do that. I'm going to paste this in, right? Okay, in this video. Now, if you're not me, you don't want to say I. You're going to say random explains okay but in this case it's me so that's okay and you can see sees the youtube video pulls up that thumbnail and uh, we're just going to post it that's it not that hard there you go full name thumbnail comes in so i've got seven posts for the guys you know most of them are videos some of them are now company announcements um you know i'm going to try and do some cad tip videos that'll that'll be fun for the technical people on my team to share so um, anyways uh there you go man that's uh that's what i set up for my team so again, just to review, uh, if you go into stuff for the stuff for the team under social media, LinkedIn, I got some banner images you can choose from. I've got some sample headlines you can use to craft your headline, and I've got seven initial posts you can share if you choose, and you're on my team. Uh, if you have suggestions about other things you can do to help your your junior technical people get started on LinkedIn, please uh, email me, text me, put it in the comments. I'm, I might do a follow-up video if I get some feedback. Thanks for watching. You guys are awesome. I appreciate it.